So once again, the media is trying to lie on the great, the good brother Dave Chappelle by saying that he somehow was trying to block affordable housing in his community of Yellow Springs, Ohio. Let's take a look at this clip. Can I go? Can you hear me? Yes. Hi, I'm Big Spell. <laughs> I just want to say, and Marianne, I can talk to you about this privately. Um, I don't know why the Village Council would be afraid of litigation from a $24 million a year company while they it's out a $65 million a year company. I cannot believe you would make me audition for you. You look like clowns. I am not bluffing. I will take it all off the table. That's all. Thank you. All right. So. What I like most about that clip is that it's Black History Month and to see this brother go in there and just lay it down and tell all them folks, no, I'm pulling my money and to show the ownership and the courage to take leadership in that position, man. That is what Black History Month is about. But the lamestream media, they, they have this thing where they love to lie on people they can't control. And since Dave, you know, is not a, a corporate puppet or under any type of sponsorships, what they do is they love to paint this narrative of build lies on him. Um, what actually happened uh, with this particular situation was number one, there was never any program for affordable houses in the first place. Uh, the land that uh, he was talking about, the, uh, the, the people in the community were primarily upset because they were gonna do like mixed use development condos and single family housing with homeowners association uh, fees and homeowners associations, which would cause restrictions and covenants in the neighborhood. And these people, they live in Yellow Springs, Ohio, it's pretty free, it's pretty open. And also the traffic it would bring, the congestion it would bring. And they weren't certain of that. And Dave went down there to say, hey, I have a huge company. I'm making a big investment. And how dare you all make me come down here to audition for you? And, and this decision should be stopped immediately. It had nothing to do with uh, affordable housing because the houses that they were trying to put in this community, in this development, we're starting in the range of three hundred thousand, like two, three hundred to six hundred thousand dollars in Ohio. And if you've been to Ohio before, uh, you would know that there's nowhere near, or has anything to do with affordable housing. These were tracts of land that these people bought and acquired, and now they're just trying to bring all this mixed-use development, retail space. And this was nothing more than the people versus big builders. And our good brother Dave came down there to stop it. So the media should stop painting these narratives and trying to destroy because this is something that Dave would never do. And, you know, only meeting this brother briefly um, and having a conversation with him briefly and him being a fellow Virgo, in my spirit, this man is not that kind of man. If he was, he certainly would have kept the $50 billion from Comedy Central, and he wouldn't be the man that we admire today. So tell that community association to call me, or the, the, the Council of uh, Yellow Springs to call, and, and let's stop to the mainstream media. Y'all call me too. And let's stop with this narrative of trying to paint our brother, our superhero, our brother Dave Chappelle, as some type of villain. I'm out.